Hello, and what we're looking at here is the structural elements that are currently installed in a very large footing. This is an industrial footing, and the reinforcement being installed here is we have a double layer, a lower and upper layer of number eight rebar, which is installed in a cross intersecting pattern, and their space approximately 12 inches on center. And this is what composes primarily the slab. Slab is approximately 12 inches thick. So this is fairly a lot of steel for this slab here. As I walk across the steel, I'm going to approach a vertical section here. We see dowel bars, and these dowel bars relate to a T-wall, which is later to be installed after the slab has been poured. And we see the vertical still going up, and I believe uh, these vertical bars here are primarily number nine bars which are installed six inches on center again just a phenomenal amount of steel uh, very heavy construction here uh, this is going to be something uh, designed to take a lot of strength uh, so we see a lot of steel being installed if you notice the foundation I don't know if the video shows it clearly but we see uh, the bars that are bent that compose the footing that goes underneath this wall here and again these are um, bars that are spaced six inches on center all the way throughout I believe this wall actually is about 50 feet long so again just a tremendous amount of steel uh, in this slab we'll walk over here we'll look at the cross section here of the footing wall and we see even along the footing wall itself there's steel bars which are placed six inches on center. I guess if you're going to build it, build it to withstand the forces that it needs to withstand. And so we have a lot of steel being installed here in this particular footing.